Hey, my name is Ed and I'd like to show you how you can learn something cool and important about trees. Direction distribution of leaves, how tree leaves are oriented, for example if they are either horizontal or pointing straight upward, is one primary parameter needed to simulate radiation transmission through canopy. The leaves absorb different amount of light depending on their orientation. With sun right up above in the sky, leaves pointing straight upward will expose smaller area towards the sun and absorb way less light than if they were horizontal. Leaf angles also affect leaf temperature, gas exchange and their water use efficiency. The thing is that with trees we cannot easily use the leaf angle measurement methods that were originally developed and worked for crops. In 1960s, scientists such as Nichiporovic, Kes David, Johan Ross and T. Nielsen estimated leaf angles using clinometers and other instruments that were placed directly on a leaf. With trees, it is not so easy, because we are here and the leaves are there. So how we can do it? We can use cameras. The original idea came from Oliver Sonentag, who told Young Ryu to put it into their paper published in Agriculture and Forest Methodology. The approach consists of using a level digital camera at several high levels of a canopy. Different levels can be accessed using letters, platforms, or by climbing, for example, Eddie Covarin's towers that are run and analyzed by people such as Dennis Baldocki of Berkeley or Timo Vesala from Helsinki. Once up there, a series of photographs of the surrounding canopy are taken at each level. Once we download the images, we inspect them for the presence of leaves oriented approximately perpendicular to the viewing direction of the camera. The leaf angles of the selected leaves are then estimated using the angle measurement tool or scripts inside the public domain image processing software called ImageJ. Fortunately, we don't have to measure all leaves out there. Pisegarel showed that with less than 100 leaves, we can obtain fairly accurate directional distribution of leaves at a whole tree level. Results indicate that using digital photography for measuring leaf angles can indeed deliver equivalent results to menu sampling for various ecosystems. Camera approach offers several practical advantages over other existing methods. First, the method is simple and much more affordable compared to the cost of three-dimensional digitizers or ground-based LiDAR systems. Second, manual sampling clinometer requires direct access to the canopy. Camera method is less restrictive. Third, the recorded images can be stored on a computer for later review. And that's it. So grab your camera and see you out there. For more information, you can ask me, email me or check the following papers.